Week four, we have a go around. So this is gating. Okay. What we need to think about during the gate is that when you first take off, you're basically still on a down and back. You've got to watch your speed that you're going because if you go too fast, what's going to happen to his foot placement? It's going to converge in if you go too fast. When we walk, go ahead and shoot my feet. When we walk, we walk straight like this. But when we increase our speed, we start to single track now. So if you take him too fast, he's going to look too close in the rear like that. So a lot of problems that people will have is when the judge says, please take this dog around, they think it's a race and they just go into a gate. You got to remember where your position is at. So you're backing away from here, you're turning and going, and you have to be aware of your rear foot placement. You can't go too fast or it will make that too narrow. But then once you get to the point where you have a side gate that you're presenting to the judge, mm -hmm. then you can open that stride. So I want you to go ahead and take him around, but I want you to be aware of where your judge is and his foot placement, so that's perfect for the judge. Very nice. Good, okay, do that with a lead now. That is such a pretty dog. Hey, hey, work together. Hey, hey. Good. Yes, excellent. Let's go. Wow. Your communication with that hand is amazing Yay! now. <laughs> Woohoo! That was a good shot. That, that was awesome. Good. Did that feel good? It, it felt awkward. You looked awesome. Because you're now starting to communicate. He's watching that hand. And he went right by the other dog over there, and it didn't, didn't phase him at all. That was fantastic. Okay, so do it with the opposite hand going the opposite direction. Now this is going to feel awkward. Yeah. This is already very awkward. <laughs> No, because you're you're trying to get him with the, the wrong hand. I know. <laughs> Good. That was beautiful. Good. That was yes. fantastic. Good job. Okay, so tell me what went through your mind when you did that. Really focused on my hand. Yeah, and, and what was the result? We were like together. Yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. See, you're, because you were doing something that's out of your comfort zone, it forced you to do what you had to do. Yeah. And so he gated for you perfectly there. Okay. So that's why it's good for you to use your right hand, use your left hand, go the correct way around the ring, go the opposite way around the ring. And most people will not do this. Most people will say, yeah, okay, I'll practice that. But they don't do that. Yeah. And, you know, a simple thing like entering the ring, they don't practice that. But you saw that it took you several times before you got that just right. Yeah. So if you could get this just right, and, and you're the best at entering the ring, if you can do the exam better than anybody else, where that judge can see all the parts, if you can do the patterns better than anybody else, the go-around better than anybody else, you and him are a team, what are, what's that going to do to your chances of winning with this dog? Yeah. It's going to just make it go over the chart because you're working so hard on things that seem so simple and that other people are taking for granted. And when they go into that ring, they're going to just shoot from the hip. And the judge is not going to be able to see everything to judge their dogs the way they can see on your dog. And if I can see everything I need to see to judge this dog, and I can't judge that dog because they're cranking into the lead or they're racking back so I can't feel or see the angles properly, mm -hmm. who's going to win? Yeah. The other thing is, too, they have to send somebody to the group. They're not going to send those dogs that are misbehaving to the group because that judge is not going to be able to examine them. Yeah. They're going to send you to the group. So 
all those things are going to be a big advantage, but they're not going to happen on their, by themselves. You have to practice this. Okay.